every human civilization for as long as it has existed. Known as the Athens of West Africa, Sierra Leone has built a name for itself upon a solid educational foundation with colonial experimental institutions such as the Grammar School, Annie Walsh Memorial School, and Forabi College, institutions which led the All Africa Way for quality education for people of African origin. Sierra Leone, a country of several pictures of courageous battles, of slavery and of colonialism, of independence and of self-rule, of civil war and of activism, of blood diamonds and of peace diamonds. Sierra Leone has emerged as a country, a concept and a conscience. Sierra Leone, the beautiful diamond of Africa. constitutional review committee. What they call CIC? The CIC, a big big committee, where they pants up all their region, tribe, religion, and all their political party. This CIC, when a constitutional review committee, then they go to all the districts, all the chiefdom, and they small small town them. So, na pozoko no lock you more. Because the one year, you boys. So, me go to the CRC meeting and tell the people they're waiting and waiting on our to make the inside the new constitution for Salon. This is body where government of Salon is self step down form for look inside the 1991 constitution. Tin and the way for pool, tin and the way for us. And I make government still say it's necessary for let them form this committee. For no more about this committee, we na call the CRC secretaries on their number here. 025-33322 or 025-33323. This message they come to you from SLBC and they get support from UNDP and CRC. This change where they change the constitution. No talk for one for no, no talk for me no more, no talk for you no more, not for me all. So make sure say you talk. Then yeah, you forget about the language you they talk. Any two you they talk, you go listen and then go put that inside you. Good morning and welcome to the program CRCR. This is now the Constitutional Review Committee. We they don't put aside for looking to the 1991 Constitution. Put this program. Um, together for CC and get the different parts, people and we concerned with regards to um, the review of the 1991 constitution. Well, inside the program, we go get for a look at waiting people and we get disability one for C in uh, the new constitution that now after they will not revise the 1991 constitution. Well, for help me discuss this again in the studio from us, Ali, we are the founder for the education, educational center for the blind and visually impaired. From us, welcome to the program. Thank you. And I also get with me Kaba Franklin Bangura. We come up from the Sierra Leone Union on Disability Issues. Um, Kaba, welcome to the program. And last but not the least, now Alima Tudin, we are the Secretary for the Information and Communication um, Committee, now the CRC. Um, Alima, welcome to the program. Good morning, listeners and viewers. Well, as you don't hear it, this this program here so today we'll have a look at the topic where now waiting people and where they live with disability one for C in the new constitution. And we all know say people and where they live with disability for a very long time don't they talk but say they know they get equal rights them in most of the things they do. I mean we then say they discriminate against them. So because of that then C say the Constitutional Review Committee will get for help them so that they will be for factor some of them things there so where they know they see inside the new constitution where then we don't review the 1991 constitution bye bye well as i say we topic now waiting the one for see well now i ask thomas ali we come up from the education uh, for educational center for the blind for tell we waiting them one for see um inside the new constitution especially from the blind people in perspective thank you very much mr moderator and uh, of course i want let viewers they know so first, first of all waiting a constitution I believe the constitution, not the 
machinery, the administrative machinery in which a state or a country uh, they work on. So that means uh, the constitution supposed for cater for everybody within that country or within that state. If I take a look at uh, the 1991 constitution, the current one we are using, it is absolutely silent on disability issues in various ways. So we are here really for uh, we talk to the CRC so that the new proposed uh, constitution we will yearn for will really um, come up with uh, entrenched clauses we go cover disability issues. If I take a look at let us say now let us uh, uh, chapter four, article thirty six talks about secret ballot in the in, in the 1991 constitution and this deals with uh, voting right we are in citizens will vote secretly where they're not going to be, be be victimized by opponents but in this light secret ballot where is the provision where the blind person or the visually impaired can go and vote independently without depending on a friend so the proposed constitution we are yearning for, I want to make, I want to suggest to CRC that um, a clause, entrenched clause, must be put in the new constitution. We are then to talk about tactile ballot guide of device that can help the blind person to vote independently. Where if we are to assure us of our secret ballot, that is one area where I want the CRC to take into consideration. Then, if I could go further as well, chapter two, uh, 3, article 18, subsection 1, talks about protect, uh, protection of freedom of movement. Okay? Every Sierra Leonean has a right to move freely within his or her community, wherever, or even outside this country. But let's take a look at uh, our building structures in this country. Can our physically challenged people really even get access to a year building. So I would suggest that the proposed constitution make sure that even every public building is accessible even to the physically challenged. But I believe even right now we are upstairs here at SABC. My, my learned brother have found it very difficult to be here. So I believe I want the constitution, probably the 1991 drafters of the, this constitution never had in mind disability issues or they never had a technocrat to advise them. That's what also I want the, the, the CRC to take into consideration. If I could also go forward, uh, chapter 2, article 9, subsection 1, A, B, C, talks about educational objectives for all. Educational objectives for all. Look at, take a look at our institutions in this country. Even the oldest university, 1827, Freebay College, where I, 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 was, uh, I, I went through, is there really educational materials that will even enhance blindness education? Do they have brave books in their library? Do they have sign language books in their library? Go to meet my guy. These are all things that the 1991 position was silent on that. It just become very broad, educational objectives for all. Okay. Well, I will go for holiday for now. That now, um, Thomas Ali, we are the founder for the Educational Center for the Blind and Visually Impaired. Now, Kaba Franklin, let I ask you, um, Thomas, your colleague, don't make a couple of points. Then he talk about secret ballots for, especially for the blind. He talk about access to buildings. Then because he didn't have the constitution in for him for free, move freely, and he also talk about educational materials they wouldn't they use way and one for see factor inside the new constitution. Let I ask you, coming from um, the Slow decide. Um, waiting now on our own point. Waiting now for see factor inside the new constitution. <clears throat> Thank you very much, uh, Mr. Modito. I think um, Mr. Ali Udin at the right track. Um, we believe see um, the 1991 constitution will get much of disability inclusiveness. So it's like um, we in Sludi, basically waiting Mr. Thomas Ali don't mention. We in Sludi, they look at in a very holistic perspective. When you watch the, the, the Persons with Disability Act of 2011, it gets all them clauses here, all them phrase them, we for make disability 
become very, we, we, we get accessibility, we get educational facility, even in the terms of voting, right? In the terms of voting, um, the, the visually impaired for for votes uh, um, uh, for votes um, through the tactile ballot guide, where everything factor inside the Persons with Disability Act. So, like we slow the, the look and say a fine for make we get a clause. We will make the National Commission for Persons with Disabilities. We get for doing the Persons with Disability Act. All the provisions with it. Then just factor a clause into that into that revised constitution. Say that all the provisions with it inside this act must be implemented, and it will be very very permanent. It will be very very sustainable when it deny the constitution and we they just as an act. And ask somebody who come tomorrow when I uh, you come and you peel them and then forget bottom. But if you don't deny as, as an entrenched clause in the constitution, it will act for me them just just um, get them away. We will look at that angle. Say um, all the educational facilities, the uh, uh, and the aspect of accessibility. Let we just get the national commission as a clause into the constitution. That now one. Then in 2012. Inside the Sierra Leone Conference on, on, this, um, on Development and Transformation, we've been getting 13 recommendations the way disabled people all over the country been come and give and present the time we've been getting the conference. Then 13 recommendations, the one been there where they talk about disability ministry, right? Where the disabled people have been called for. We want to let that kind of thing factor in, in this coming revised constitution. Not a salon no more, don't do one. And they tell you, even in Uganda, Right? Even, um, so yesterday I've been, I've been watch internet, you get Department of Disability Affairs in India. Right? So continue the way they practice them. Right? And we, we, we said that we will look again to that particular close day for be factor. If they want to make disabled people and status, they're very, 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 um, they be part of the, 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 the development of this country, that aspect day for day. Then the other aspect, we are not asking for much. But if we able to get them fitting here inside the constitution coming, we believe, say, the sustainability of disability, improvement in status, and uh, in inclusion, implementation, and everything don't be factored. You look at the legislative aspect. We say, we the propose, say, make it be five seats where it will be a safe seat for people with disabilities. We want them that this constitution coming. The reason why make we want them. Obviously, in 2012 uh, 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 Parliament, we may get a disabled person there. We, we um, fortunately, we get a symbol from the political party where he belong and he be a member. But 2012 to 2018 or 17 now, we not get a why. Because you find out that most disabled people like you want to go into politics. But you look at the economic aspect. Now, one, you look at the social stigma. Now, two, you look at even people and look disabled people and say they're not able to participate into their mainstream developments than they. So, we are in like in Uganda, they get five seats. We are in the disabled people and they vote for them people and they where they go represent them. You will be there now, like um, the issue, like, like we form an honorable member of parliament. So, you go to the city and they vote separately or they not vote under like a constituency, like they happy now. Why is the voting? For, why is the that that just for disabled people? Yes, yeah, just for the disabled people. The one the way they want for where they go occupy their seats, then they now Uganda, now they are in parliament. So, we they look at that. Because then they go reduce some of the stigma, the economic problem we go get in time of look I'm like the forthcoming election and go say uh, if we pay 10 million, 20 million outside the same report. Someone said even we don't get you qualification. For let you get to work now, problem. You understand? Some of them others and they so we they look at that, say we want let the the forthcoming okay. revised constitution look at that aspect. Now a very, very important okay. aspect we we we, we 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 actually don't come up. So now then treating and they the Persons with Disability Act for be factored. The five seats in terms of legislative who want to propose for make a day. Then even the disability ministry. Okay. When the disabled people have been don't cry for, we will be look at the, the Sierra Leone conference for the next 50 years. A day inside one of the recommendations. Well, I want another a ministry we go handle disability. Yeah, because we think though, one I want to justify that. We already get the disability commission. Okay. One person would think, say, like, it will just be, then we just uh, we get two parallel institutions. No, but you know, go talk, you can talk about the National Youth Commission, they get the uh, uh, Ministry of Youth Affairs. For that, 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 for common thing. What you try for sale is like 
the department will forget a ministry where they look at disability issue now a very technical issue now an issue where we deal with blind person how you deal with blind person a different to the way they deal with polio person a different to the way they deal with somebody where na albino a different to how they deal with somebody where na epilepsy patient you different to how they deal with somebody where na mentally retarded well, you from. know some of them thing and day okay, so that from. that's make with a call on that aspect they say what a disability ministry where it goes technically and professionally look at the angle and work with the disability commission well, thank you very much um Kaba franklin bongura from studi let me um, bring on board alima tudin Alima, you don't hear really the concerns of both speakers then. Um, the previous speaker talked about secret ballot for especially the blind. He talked about access to building them as the, as because they don't get the facilities, they may restrict their movement into certain um, places to them for when also the creation of um, educational materials them way way before aid them education. But um Kaba Franklin emphasized one major thing we see they want separate seats then, five at least five seats then. We did to uh, we were allocated to disabled people. Then now you come up from um, the CRC information side. How you see the, the concerns of the disabled people? Then? Yeah, this now concern where they touch the one whole nation because when you talk about disabilities, um, now people that we physically get that you know, so you they see them all over the nation. Any side where you go, you they see them. And we really know say them be done become they be done left out. No way not be there where them be they manage them or bring them can on board. Like where uh, um, um, Mr. Thomas Sally they talk about institution them where they know they get access for claim from from uh, um, downstairs for go they they not get it. They, we really won't be visit them. Then talk bring the issues then come out. Then recommend but railings them, railing where they go able to touch like then straight cut railings then and then higher high uh, um them building the government building them so that then say we will get access for the the uh, and be then go able to use them building them they then then talk about the street even the street self uh, um they not get footpaths for disabled people there especially but they got new cover, so. yeah yeah we'll not get footpaths because you didn't have footpaths other uh, uh, bike common and that car inside footpaths so then issue here so he really saw you what they talk about uh, um disabilities but we they we they go and talk with them because we want their voice for be heard now as i they talk to you so the eight subcommittees then scatter all over they visit the MDAs for no they own, they own uh, um, uh, um, waiting and waiting they want inside the constitution. So as then they give them views them, would they write them down? Would they take them at the plenaries? Who say would they go discuss them views them? And moreover, the, we them we get for then get for write them policy uh, um, um, then get for write them position papers them. They get for fill the submission forms them and waiting and waiting all they want to them they talk about all go there inside the. Uh, 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 um, position papers them and then go able to feel and find we will go able to know their needs them but when we they do all them consultations they are we we know they find it difficult with them because they really open up to we to, to we mm. and they really they tell me what's in their mind just like how um uh, um the rep, the chairman for the president for slew the CSEP, they talk well concerning this uh, um secret ballot the uh, um uh, um uh, um, election management bodies themselves, me no say ten go the force for let them put things in place. We go make them safe. Go no the people they not go know outside and they vote. It go be secretly. We don't say secret ballot. It is self forget you you Yes, if it be a secret ballot, not supposed to they take you and put and so you know where's them go there where they go bring them up for let this go happen. But really. We brothers and we sisters then we don't become left out. Don't like this education for all. You know, say really we not say the gadgets they're very expensive, but if the, the they don't bring and come up now to the constitution constitutional review committee, all that one they will get for, for, for debate on them. Because really, like for, for cater for them kind people they are so if we're not able to cater for them. The your level of ed education, you go just stop like then class four, class five. Because when they go reach to Beke level, it's not going to be easy for them. For they among people, the way they see, where they touch, where they feel, before the thing they reach, the, the knowledge they reach them, it don't collapse. So, okay. 
All right, thank you very much, Ali Matu. I'll go all the day, come back to Thomas Salih. Now, the concerns that we want to raise, um, I hope, say, we want to really try for the national, for letting them reflect to all disabled people. Because why are they ask, waiting they affect disabled and affect on, not can likely be the thing where they affect disabled than other parts of the country. Because if you ask a disabled, uh, maybe a small village, maybe you can get with you one. So I just want to know, like, you really represent the blind and come out from the Educational Center for the Blind and Visually Impaired. How the concerns the way they raise, how national then they, uh, other than just for disabled in the city? Yes, Mr. Moderator, I want, I want to assure you that what we are seeing here is a get a national character and a get for get impact on all blind people and disabled people as a whole. And the other area, even where I want to push forward, uh, where uh, I believe, say, a go find for we get in the new constitution is the area of having access to justice. If we take at uh, the rules of evidence and procedure, when a statutory uh, uh, instrument, when a law a parliament make, we have blind people who go to court, and we have blind people where they get conflict with the law. But it will interest you to know, Mr. Moderator, that the rules of uh, evidence and procedure, they only talk say, where you go na court, the evidence where they give, now wait till they see. Have you not left out the blind? The blind person where we will give evidence according to in sense of hearing. Like when me they talk now, now, if you get conflict with me, I can ident identify your voice if we go to court. But that rules of uh, evidence and procedure automatically don't left out. If somebody sees advantage for itself, we go to court, they say, well, you know, you know they see, we will not, we'll not believe in that kind of evidence. Uh, this happened one of my students was grossly beaten years back and he took uh, the, uh, the people that were then beaten to court and uh, Alunsa, that was under uh, magistrate uh, Ganda. So I drove, I went down there, they wanted to throw that case out because the man know they see in Ogwebu Tele. Which I tell them? When I put the accused people in the dock and let them talk one after the other, whether the, 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 the complainant we will identify them. And they were all shocked. They able to call them and identify them all by name. So there are rules of evidence and procedure. I want the night they propose constitution for change automatically so that even the, 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 the evidence of hearing could be in that constitution so that the blind and uh, will not be left out at all. Then of course, even the, the visual uh, the hearing impaired, do we have police officers where they know sign language? Because these are people also where they get conflict with the law. They need to train police personnel for handle their own matter to know exactly so that they say they can have access to justice. So what we are saying here, Mr. Moderator, is going to affect the lives of the blind, the physically challenged, the hearing impaired, so it gets a national character. I want to assure you that. Okay, just before I come over to Kaba again, I will still um, ask you the same thing. Many a times people in the city, um, even disabled them, they know they know they know unite in their fight so how how united on a day because if you talk to different different organizations and something and you you are not unite so how uh, united on a really day for push for waiting on a design uh, i could also say uh say categorically say able body person also are very much disunited so it's a nature it's in it's a it's a it's, a, it's an innate character that is in man not only disabled person well, however, what I can say here, we, when we have good leaders, we can bring the few together, definitely. And I believe we, are, we started the ball rolling. And under the umbrella of SLUDI, the commission, we are going to bring everybody on board. So it's not only common in disabled people, but the general human race as a whole. Kaba, you don't agree with the famous I mean, the national center that I really want for emphasize because um, disabled and right across the country and we work, and I believe see the constitutional review committee self one for really see say, all man participate in the process. Do we know we forget all man for sit on one bag and talk? But I mean, we know they represent them. We know really um, pass on the views of the people they need. Yeah, um, I think the national side, um, as Mr. Ali don't say, a very very paramount and it, 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 we. They look things in a very national perspective. 
I've been listening with the CLC, they're there for engaging the consultation. Then go meet some of most of them issues here where they come up with that all decide the way they get for go. Then go meet them. Some of them don't they do consultations. They don't visit some groups them, some rooms them. They will tell you see some of them here where they talk. They meet them there. And one thing part the same people now one great message with the carry when they do advocacy and inclusion. Any side we go to the country, they will tell you about inclusion. We want for be recognized. We want for be part. People are not for the think but we. You understand? Being in the parliament, having five seats in the parliament, the confusion where the honorable coffee been they get, where they did the parliament, the same people in the field say that disability they represent the parliament. They say they do nothing for we. Then the <laughs> constituents where they represent, then they castigate and say, honorable Kofi, not just disability business in the carry on normal parliament. But technically, we watch him, he was representing constituency 109. Right, but if they agitate disability issues in parliament, so if they, if they get two front, two front uh, uh, accusation, but we are in where they get with five seats where them people and then are purely on disability make them go under any two way happen, they now that they will be all responsible. Any two way, any issue will come up, they will not happen now. Then five people and they will get that the par that parliament that they will be all responsible when it comes to the ministry, the executive. Here now, we, we, we glad you because we get a president now where we get passion for disabled people. First time in the history, they appoint a deputy minister. It's good. First time in the history of Sierra Leone, wrong get a member of parliament, although he noted again. But what we, are, what we are saying here, when did they sit in the cabinet? Now we get a disabled minister. Where a minister, they, they agitate disability issues. The commission are not they, they, they attend cabinet. That's a justification of having a disability ministry. You understand? So all we, 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 we issue about disability is nationalistic, uh, Mr. Moderator. It's everywhere. And when TRC then go start their consultation, they go believe, say, they go meet the same kind of issue how they discuss so that television say now this the disabled people they want. TRC will not get to work for the Alim Alima Boku thing and the way all sets of people and the woman then the picking them, all man they raise them concerns them. Within one for seeing the next constitution or the revised constitution, how we not go able for say say we factor within the disabled people they want so that we not go left them out this time around. Well, that is why we they get them consultation yeah, so with them. We they go meet them, na the organization them, and talk with them because na the mandate that way the constitutional review give it. Now we they go meet them and talk to them. Then when would they talk to them? Would they bring and kind of the plenary and discuss them? Would they really discuss them? At the end of the day, you know, say voting can take place if among we for law take decisions then. Whether term day they reach, we not say go no. Like we, eh, eh, we don't make them transparent so now. Now, Mr. Aliu and Mr. Kabasi don't so now, the one who will really listen to them. So that they show the kind way how constitutional review committee transparent. In all time, like the, the previous one them, where them be they just go sit down and get at themselves make constitution. No. This so now on very all, transparent. Not just on all waiting, like for example, the disabled people will ask for una go able for factor, una go able for taking to consideration, so una open to maybe like negotiations. Really, it no go be say all waiting and go ask for go day inside this one green book. This one green book will become very bulky. If we say all waiting disabled and they ask for go day day. Now that make the constitution self it gets for make the uh, uh, um, act themselves become powerful. Because if the act they not become powerful, me and you not go able. Like Salomon can say, na me right. Salomon, he not say the constitution na India right. The constitution is very important. Because like where the uh, 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 president passed that uh, uh, state of emergency, and the constitution get the right. Now that's not other good example. So like where we go reach pan, some, we go reach na some area them, where some man go make like they avoid, not a thing that to avoid all. Now, my own brother then sit down so now, they advocate on behalf of their own people, them, where then they govern. So, where it come and come, it affects we all. Okay, well, I'll ask um, Kabag, we'll start with you this time around. Um, we don't hear you from the person um, from Alima to come from CLC. Definitely not to everything that we will for take. Um, that means we're not get for prioritize what we want. Um, I think this is the main thing that we want to really. 
we will not need for now so that we will put the one away maybe less important against small and we will put the one away when I think say that the most important thing yeah. we will need. Well, um, um, let me tell you, say, um, we not believe say that everything we disabled people need to talk about is factored into constitution because there are some issues we na constitutional matters. So issue the way not to constitutional matters. You understand? The issue the way get for do with constitution. We get for do with legislative legislative representation. We go want that. The issue we get for do with executive representation. I think a constitutional matters. You understand? The issue we get for do with judiciary as we go that they talk about access to justice. Na 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 constitutional matters. You understand? So it's like we know they see that everything we but there are key things. Like can I tell you, the persons with disability act make provisions of all the things we don't talk to now. A day day. Just a simple clause. Don't cover everything. Don't make the, the act, the commission, don't permanent. Don't get power, more power for doing work. With a commission, with a, 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 a ministry. Having somebody, the commission and not they go cabinet. But if we get a disability ministry, where would they get somebody? Because as they tell you disability issues, you say say go watch them now a very, very technical and professional aspect. When you need somebody, you know they say now a person where disabled for go and do that kind of position there or whatnot. But when we get a technocrat, a specialist in disability, we don't have people that do they do, do masters in disability, doctorate in disability studies. We don't have any people they do they, they do special courses on disability studies, right? Some of them say that you get say kind people and they into a ministry where they are an old ministry and they know how to take care of somebody when I mentally retarded. And they know how to take care of somebody when I polio, when they don't become polio affected. Somebody with multiple, we get multiple disabilities. Let me tell you about one thing what travel in Germany. They get a policy where I don't think it in a salon. If a disabled person need an assistant, you they apply na the local council, then council for request for an assistant. We go to move out with chair, we go to work out with times of tell a visually impaired. At the end of the month, at the local council, the council na in the pair. You understand? Some of the things that they they are there, they are out there. You look at the aspect of uh, 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 um, um, so everything we get for do with legislative. Okay. We disabled people want to have. Yeah. Anything we get for do it executive, disabled people want to have. Anything we get for do it judiciary. Now that make a belief say the CRC there in nine committees. The okay. CRC member just will tell before, me that. Just before I take the text message, I will put the same question also to um, Thomas. Thomas, um, prioritizing, waiting, the, for example, the blind people they need for see inside this constitution, or other than taking a bulk of almost yeah, everything yeah. they want. Mr. Bodreto, uh, I believe. Um, Disabled people, they don't say na different human beings. I believe waiting when they talk about affecting your own life as a good person. So we are not asking much. If we see ju access to justice, you yourself need justice, not much. If we want to see the police be independent, not having order from above, it affect your life, it affect the disabled person. So we are not asking much. But what can guarantee our survivor as a human being what can guarantee our, 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 our recognition in a state called Sierra Leone? That's what we are asking for. Not much, but thing that can affect your life and our, our life as a whole. But we have been so much marginalized because of the negative social cultural beliefs where people then get uh, towards disability issues. I believe we should throw away this concept now and let the society uh, know that if only you give the required support, so disabled people, they can even contribute more to the development of Sierra Leone. I can always say that we have more level of concentration. And I have said in my speeches that if more disabled people are given um, a position in terms of governance, Sierra Leone would have been a peak to, the, to, to, have been a, to a pinnacle of development. Because since 1960 up to this point, able body are ruling the country, but we are still okay. right. Well, I'll, I'll, take, I'll take the, the text messages that we don't count at the program so far. Well, this one come up from post we seen a concerned citizen and he say, I want for me the CRC provide equipment of learning to the institution there, especially equipment for the blind so that they go for access, quality, education. They come up from a concerned citizen. 
the other one coming from Alpha Banks, that part in street, and he say, Mr. Bongura, I say, I agree with you. Say, the rate of discrimination at workplace, them say, is so high. He say, so I want for the CRC to take into consideration the three things the way you don't highlight. It come on from Alpha Bangura on our party street. And the last one for now come on um, from another concerned citizen and he say disabled woman and then they suffer more or not them vulnerable more than the society today. He says so CRC I want for let una do something for transform the, the lives of disabled people and especially women them. Well I will start with you um CRC most of the text messages then they ask the three things the way Mr Kaba talk about and the other one the way uh, Mr um of course, I you talk about see edu educational materials, see that thing that will really affect people, and so the while they want to take them into consideration, and also woman them among the disabled people, and woman them we um, the person say them more vulnerable. Yeah, I, I go start from beneath. Like when they talk about the disabled women, they way more vulnerable. Who they see them at their wheelchair, then all them picking them, then all them load them inside the wheelchair. They go and fend them their daily living. So like all that one day. But the CRC, we get the mandate for talk with them as well then they bring out their views then so. Because they get two representatives them inside the committee. They get the National Commission for um, the physically people and uh, people with disabilities, when I'm Mr. Van de Kone, then with Mr. Franklin Kaba Kaba. When I when are the umbrella organization for when I now they call Sludi the Sludi uh, um, president and then I also with we uh, instead then at the constitutional review committee if then two people then they they among the eighty members then they they not go easy for let them trample upon the rights them they not go left see them they make decisions then we not go favor them and we self self we know how especially the one that like we be asked but the disabled the way they are the provinces if not the same thing then they go through. Really, me, me, me brother, the, me, me, um, I can feel why they see the disabled the way they are the provinces. Their life is really miserable. Where they upline, most of we found the way disabled upline. Then they feel they're not, they're not useful again. Although then they do them basket weavery, then they do other work then. But if you're not able to attack yourself, you're not useful. So we really get them at heart. We really get them at heart. Because like we go sit down on, on we meetings then. We get them cases then for 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 discuss, you see. And inside this uh, um, country, we not go want let one person become powerful than the other. Mm -hmm. Now you make we get the constitution. Now you make we sit down by this constitution for review the areas there. So. Okay, we well, try for round up now. But I will ask you, Kaba Franklin, and I will get for put the same question again to from Osali. Um, when I talk, but several issues them for most of the program, but will not be mentioned about the vulnerability of women them. Um, among the disabled people in Macboy, text are just raised. I mean, I believe in something we also we you know, for for the advocate for because anyhow you look at two man, whether he able or disabled, they're more vulnerable to some certain things that will happen. I think um, the woman very right, but whenever we talk about disability issues, no say it involve all gender. Mm -hmm. You understand? And um, although when you look at the the high rate of vulnerability, they go to disabled women. They are more, more, and more, and more vulnerable than even the disabled men. But what we, what we say now, as soon as that um, uh, the issue that we don't come up with so again for affect the women with disabilities, and they affect children with disabilities. They get for affect even the, the 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 male with disabilities. So it's like um, we not left them out. They are part of the it. And one of the texts has them just agree with me again, say the discrimination so high. Right, places, for make yeah. you see a, a visually impaired person. I remember the two honorable Kofi, um, honorable Attila, the minute battle for a constituency. I meet them at the constituency, I know waiting people, let me be say, right? We get for do with stigma, we get for do with provocation, we get for do with a lot of socioeconomic embarrassment, you know. Some of them discrimination, and they, I believe, see the first way they support we, and indeed, CRC go agree with me. When they go start the consultation full of the provinces, they go meet all the issues here, disabled people then come up with that. And we get for come up with a position paper. At the end of the day, we get for call is take key stakeholders meeting and come up with them and submit them to C to CRC. You know. And once you are they talk about disability, the, the latest world disability report say 15% of the world population, right? 
comprise of disabled people. Okay. So not just look blind, you just look deaf, you just look uh, amputee, you just look. You have you have fourteen different category of disabled people in each and every country. Okay, but well, right. Thomas, also your reaction to the t text messages then, because um, uh, like just waiting, Frank, we don't do people that don't really they raise concerns them with discrimination at workplaces and also women them being vulnerable in terms of um, um, disability. Yes, uh, Mr. Moderator, you're right. Generally, women are uh, vulnerable. There you, there you talk about disabled uh, women, so not double disabilities or vulnerability you can think of. So what we are discussing here, really, it is elastic, as Mr. Bangura just don't say. We they take into consideration even children, whatever we are discussing here. If, if we are going to provide access uh, to education, automatically that affects children, women, and everybody. If we are saying that uh, the government or the constitution for make sure say all public um, uh, institutions should provide the required uh, equipment we need to enhance our work, we are talking about women as well and as, uh, as, as children. So our discussion here is not left them out at all. And uh, we need special attention for them, especially women. You know, if women, able bodied women, they are saying they are vulnerable, how about now those who are disabled? So really, we are talking about all of them, and okay. we only hope that uh, though the drafters of the proposed constitution will take into consideration our views. Okay, uh, Thomas, I will stay with you for your roundup statement as we try for roundup. We we'll get a few minutes we don't left. Um, we think will be a roundup um, statement with regards to all we do not discuss um, for push disability business um, go before, especially you, where they represent the blind. I want to appeal to the drafters of the uh, proposed constitution and the government as a whole, that disability issue uh, is really now giving due attention, but we need more. Because if we have uh, a blind minister, we have a commissioner who is blind, then I think uh, in those days, you can never think of that. We, we are limited to the four corners of our home, then look out for charities. I think gradually we are kicking that out. So I want the drafters of this constitution to take our views into consideration and the government as a whole. That is my last statement. Thank you very much, Thomas Aliu from the Educational Center for the Blind and Visually Impaired. Um, Kaba Franklin, your roundup statement. Well, my roundup statement are that I try for lobby this balance 78 CRC members when the plenary will start. These are the issues of disabilities and this now the issue that we, we want for day inside the constitution in terms of the legislative, judiciary, and even the executive. One for AEC now, really, disabled people, them, really um, be part of this. So we lobby, we the talk, to so even with CIC members then, when the plenary will start on the issues, they be lay the support we, as disabled people, them, for make sure, say, this constitution coming a disability inclusive. Okay, yes, um, I will come to you, Alima, too, because you know you get for do most of the talking because all the recommendations, the way they don't come with all the, the suggestions, the way they don't come with, say, they want to see that the new constitution they go towards our committee. Um, see, um, constitutional review committee, um, with the appeal to um, MDAs as well and the SLUD and other organization, them. Educational Center for the Blind, like we already are so the appeal they go out there now. We still the appeal say make they write them um, position papers them because inside your position paper now you know what you they put there. It, 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 it perfectly confidential. So what you they write inside your position paper, you either type it or you draw in written, you will get some position papers there already now where they don't send in. Where you don't Factor and inside the position paper, it don't reach to we. Now, what do you want? Now, the constitution and the inside the position paper. So, now that we get for debate on, um, for make it go uh, down inside the constitution. Then, um, I go talk say to my fellow Sierra Leoneans, them, this na time for when they say constitutional review issues, it costs sleep, sleepless nights. Why I say so? So man go say, hey, this is not to me business. But it can for affect you. Because what's in the app with Salomon Sabi say, Nami right. What's in the guild right? Now the constitution. 
This constitution, they help, help for safeguard with prestige, especially of natural resources. It they monitor we right, it they protect we right them as citizens, it they protect we from governmental abuse. Person you not know, they like I don't begin for say just no one person you not know, they get weight passing company. Okay. This on any constitution. But before they left, make a left with website ex, uh, um, address yes. to them. Mm -hmm. Um we office address my Miata Conference Hall we building. Anybody where you want to do individual submission, you can go there. As an organization, you can still write them, you go there. Then the website address now, www, small letters, constitutional review, dot, g -O -V dot, s -L. Right, thank you very much. Well, now so the program, we now, of course, CRC Argo and for today, we thanks to my panelists, then Thomas Ali, we come up from um, the Educational Center for the Blind and E, of course, in, uh, the founder of that organization there, and we get Kaba Franklin Mangura, we are the president for the Sierra Leone Union on Disability Issue, and the only woman, of course, in the program, Nabi Alima Tudin. We are the secretary to the Information and Communication Committee, na CRC. Me, we bring the program come to you on behalf of the SLBC and me, producer, I'm David Patrick Kamar. Say don't hear you for constitutional review committee. What then they call C I C. The C I C na big big committee where they pan tap all the region, tribe, religion, and all the political party. This C I C when a constitutional review committee, then they go na all the districts, all the chiefdoms, and then small small town them. So na for Zako no lucky more. Because the one year, you boys. So, me family, go to the CRC meeting and tell me people they're waiting and waiting on want to make the inside the new constitution for Salon. This is a body where government of Salon is step step down form for look inside the 1991 constitution. Tin and the way for pool, tin and the way for art. And that may government still say it's necessary for let them form this country. For know more about this committee, we na call the CRC secretariat on their number zero two five three 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 two two or zero two five three 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 two three. This message they come to you from SLBC, and they get support from UNDP and CRC. This change where they change the constitution, not so for one person, no, not so for me no more, not so for you no more, not for we all. So make sure say you talk. Then hear you. Forget about the language you they talk. Any two way they talk, you go listen and then go put that inside you.